Hello and welcome back to another video. In this video we'll be comparing the S58 found in the X3M and X4M to the S58 found in the M3 and M4. They are not exactly the same, just to be clear there is only one S58, the S58B30T0, which is engraved with S58B30A. However, as soon as you open the bonnet of an X3M and M3 you will notice that the engine bays look quite different. Some of the differences are only related to packaging the engine in the available engine bay space, but one difference surprised me, and I'm sure will surprise you too. As the SUV body is taller there is more space vertically, which I believe is the reason for most of these differences, the first noticeable difference is the engine cover. In the X3M and X4M, the engine cover also serves at the intake muffler box and houses four air filters. However in the M3 and M4, the engine cover is slimmer and more traditional, and there are separate air intake muffler boxes housing more traditional air filters. I believe there would not have been enough space height-wise to place the X3M type engine cover in an M3. Due to the different engine cover, the oil filler cap is placed on a neck in the case of the X3M and X4M, whereas this neck is not found in the M3 and M4. Due to the different intake muffler box configuration, some of the air ducts are also different. Although it might be related to the different ducting, it is worth noting that there is a different intercooler part number. Although visually they appear to be the same, the intercoolers in the M3 and M4 have an additional attachment point. There is also different bracing in the engine bay between the X3M or X4M and M3 or M4, which might again be due to the engine cover, but it may also be due to the different chassis stiffness of the SUV body versus the more traditional saloon or coupe body. The bracing does seem to be closer to the DME in the M3 and M4, compared to the X3M and X4M where the DME sits lower. Another interesting difference is that the coolant expansion tanks are shaped differently and located differently between the two engine bays. In the X3M and X4M they are spherical with the engine coolant expansion tank located on the left-hand side of the engine bay, aft looking forward, away from the turbochargers, and the intercooler coolant expansion tank is on the right-hand side of the engine bay, close to the turbochargers. On the other hand in the M3 and M4, the larger engine coolant expansion tank is on the right-hand side of the engine bay, close to the turbochargers, and the intercooler coolant expansion tank is close to the intercooler at the rear left of the engine bay. Another interesting difference is the oil pan. In the case of the X3M and X4M there is a shaft passage through the oil pan whereas in the M3 and M4 there is no such shaft passage. I am not sure if the shaft passage is due to the X3M and X4M being X-Drive by default, and if therefore it would be the same if the M3 or M4 were X-Drive versions. Nevertheless there is a difference. On the left of your screen is an M3 competition, and on the right is an M3 competition X-Drive, so they pretty much look the same under the hood. If you have an X-Drive version of the M3 or M4, have a look at your oil pan, and let us know if there is a shaft passage or not. I proceeded to compare various parts in the illustrated parts catalog and unsurprisingly I found many similarities, for example same turbocharger part numbers, cylinder head part number, piston and rod part numbers, high pressure fuel pump part number, etc. There are some radiator and tubing differences which can be explained due to the chassis dimension differences. However I did find one interesting difference which I cannot explain. The crankshaft of the X3M and X4M is a different part number compared to the M3 and M4. As the engines all produce the same power in both competition and non-competition versions, it is not obvious why the crankshaft would be a different part number, so if anyone knows please do post a comment below. It continues to be my belief that the competition versions of the engines are only a different tune and do not have any different hardware compared to the non-competition versions. So there are four versions of the S58 you can find, the basic S58 for X3M and X4M, the S58 for X3M and X4M with competition tune, the S58 for M3 and M4, and the S58 for M3 and M4 with competition tune. That's it for this short video, 
I thought it was interesting that BMW has different configurations of the S58, which was not obvious in my previous videos. I would love to know of any more confirmed differences in the comments below. I did not go through the illustrated parts catalog in great detail, so there might be more changes. In any case, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.